Okay. Alright, everybody, so we're gonna look at some more Skimpy mods. Oh, you guys' favorite. <laughs> uh, anyway, it's the. This is gonna be five more mods. So we're gonna first look at the Witch, the Wild. So, anyway. Uh, I do little tattoos for this, as you guys are gonna see. Anyway. Look at this. Pretty badass looking. Pretty skimpy, whatever you wanna say. Anyway, if you go to the tanning rack. Uh, you're first gonna go under, I think it's Misk, and there's gonna be the Voodoo doll, which you're just gonna need in your inventory, just one leather strip, and then craft all the stuff up. Uh, one's gonna be actual just armor, plus the cloak. Um, then one's not, it's just gonna be like clothes, so. If you want armor, or if you don't, whatever your pick is. It's better if you have armor if you're just playing through the game, I would assume, you know. So it does come in different colors. It does look good, as you guys can see. Like I said, I love the tattoos. It's also emerald. Let's look at the emerald. We're gonna go with emerald. Yeah. Emerald. There we go. Oh, it looks a little different too. Nice. Oh, interesting. Uh, the tattoos kind of remind me of a. Uh, if you guys play Borderlands, it reminds me of Siren Tattoos. Um, I don't know if that's just me, but it just kind of does. Also, Ruby is nice. Um, a lot of tattoos that match it, too. Yeah, like I said, it does look like Siren Tattoos. I don't know, but it does look pretty cool, though. Uh, there's also Cloak, if you guys like Cloaks. You also don't have to wear it, but it does look pretty cool in character. You know, I always like the option of wearing stuff, which is always cool. Anyway, guys, we're going to go to the next mod, and let's have a little fun. Alright, everyone, so the second mod, we get the Chameleon Armor. So this is pretty interesting. It has a customal, customizable set of armor that works for body slides. It says it works for, like, most body types, it looks like. Works the one I have on. So if you go under high, you can just craft everything for pretty much five leather strips um, in different colors. So much to craft, so it's always nice. The funny thing is about this mod is you can make it a skimpy or you can make it not skimpy. <laughs> so there's like other you know looks you can do with this. Plenty of different looks and plenty of different colors actually. Get the corset, you know, you can do it without the corset. Just boots you can wear. You can also have it like this in the thumbnail, like it was in the mod thumbnail. So I do like that customizability, so you know, customizability? Yes, there we go, set it right. Kinda. Of. <laughs> but yeah, it's you don't often see where you can actually get um Super skin, uh, skimpy, then not super skimpy. So it's, uh, that's pretty cool. You can just change it however you want. Uh, there's also red. I want to see the red. You like the hair too that it comes with. So that's pretty cool. Yes, yeah, so like I said, you just. You know, switch everything around. Ooh, I like the design of the red. That's pretty cool. Huh. Anyway, guys, let's go on to the next one. There's also, like, a few other colors that you guys can see here. And there's also the jewelry and stuff like that. So, pretty cool. Alright, going for the third mod. We are going to look at the pirate mod. So basically this one, if you go under, I believe it's leather? Yeah, it's right here. For individual things, there's a bunch of different things you can you know, change up. So we're actually gonna look at those. So uh, I guess we'll look at pirate set one. And <laughs> it shows a picture what you're gonna look like. Then there's also the individual ones that it looks like. You can um, change everything up. It looks like you just change the boots and stuff like that. And clothes. There we go. A lot of boots. 
So basically with the sets, you can just change up however you want it. Which is kind of cool. I do like the way it looks. Um, does it, it's kind of interesting that it looks like as the sets go on, it gets skimpier. <laughs> uh, but it's kind of funny that the armor actually goes down with it. Surprised it actually does that. So it is pretty cool looking. Let's go on to the next one. Set two. Oh. Wait, what does it actually remove? Oh, it kind of like just changes the belt and stuff. Okay. I like this one too. Awesome. There's like immediately no, <laughs> no pants. <laughs> it's a big change. Um, but then it's even more gone. Wait, what does it remove? Oh, it removes that, okay. Yeah, I like it without that. So probably set three is my favorite. I don't know. And then it's that one. Set seven. So this one's basically just under her. <laughs> <Underwear. laughs> it's kind of interesting. Anyway, guys, let's go on to the, you know, fourth mod, and I'll be back in a second. Alright, so, for our good old fifth, fourth mod, not fifth mod. Um, so this is gonna bring some, uh, color to your game, which is the flower dress, oh yeah. That's where I saw it, and I was like, okay. It's gotta go in here, but if you go to studded, this will be able to craft it here, be able to craft here, um... You need leather strips, some leather, and some iron ingots, and you're gonna look good. It actually gives you a decent amount of armor, which is pretty good. Usually, stuff like this doesn't give you that much armor, but this does give you a lot of armor. So this is what it's gonna look like. Looks pretty good for your character. Um, very pretty. Like the colors do stand out a lot. And definitely like the way it looks like. Uh, but yeah, you'll stand out. Uh, probably not the best idea. Um, you're gonna not want to die because, well, unless you're badass and want to attract enemies and be like, oh, you can't defeat me. I'm too powerful. I don't know. If that's the way you play, that's definitely <laughs> different. Like I said, it is pretty cool. You know, it looks like it actually is just like a part of the flower, just part of your body. Like that looks kind of like a tulip or something like that, upside down. I don't know. Anyway, guys, let's go on to the last mod, and I'll be back in a second. Alright, so the last one is the, the Vittoria um, VC's Secret. I think that's supposed to be a pun, obviously. <laughs> so it has a set um, of craftable armors for the game. Um, anyway, you can just craft all these. Once you get a book, and they're actually in each crafting section of everywhere. Let me know, I might have it stored away. Um, and like all the sections like Daedric and all that kind of things. But one of the convenient places to find it will be here. Not actually right here. I already picked it up. Yeah, but you can grab all, all of them right there. Or well, one of them right there. There's other other two locations if you guys want to go to those. But there's also the you know awesome look of this. So that's pretty awesome. So they get all these. Just go under like um let's just say leather. There's some under leather. Sticky. There's Nightingale ones, which is pretty cool. There's one under Elven, um, there's Orcish, El Ebony, Glass, Dragon, Daedric, all that kind of good stuff. You know, pretty cool set of armors. Um, as you guys can see here, literally just skimpy armors. Literally matches the title. <laughs> so I love when that, you know, conveniently, like that. Don't like the Dwarven. I just don't like the bulkiness of Dwarven and the colors of Dwarven. So that's def definitely not my uh, cup of tea, is Dwarven sets. Uh, it does still look cool though, whatever your opinion is on it. I do like the look of Ebony armor. But yeah, they do look pretty cool. Um, you got you know, skimpy Elven armor. Then you just got random sets like this. You know, leather sets. So you can mix and match however you like it. 
Evangelion is pretty cool. Anyway, guys, that is pretty much it for the video. You know, download all these mods and you know, make your character look good however you want to. So, hope you guys did the video. Please like and subscribe if you did, and I'll see you guys later.